Hello, this is Tanner, and today I'm bringing you basil pesto. Now this is a quick five minute recipe that has five ingredients in it. And all you need is a food processor or mortar and pestle. In my case here, I'm gonna take the cheats way out and use the food processor. So what we wanna do to start is add our basil, garlic, pine nuts, pinch of salt and pepper, then we're gonna put our lid on and blitz it for about 30 seconds. After the 30 seconds is up, as you can see here, the texture resembles damp breadcrumbs. From here, we're going to add three quarters of our cheese, put our lid back on, and blitz it again for another 30 seconds. Now during this time, we're gonna add half our olive oil. Now I'm not using measurements here, I'm taking the easy way, but if this is your first time, feel free to use measurements. Now after this second session of grounding, you can see the consistency and texture is a bit finer here, and this forms the base of our basil pesto. Now the beauty of basil pesto is that it's very versatile and you can use it in many, many dishes. I'll list a few of these ways down below in the description, but my favorite use of all time is to simply stir it through pasta. Add basil pesto to some fettuccine or spaghetti and it tastes beautiful. Now if you want a bit more flavor to it, feel free to add the rest of your cheese and depending on your consistency, you can add a little bit more olive oil if you'd like to. But as I said earlier, it is a very versatile recipe and you can just adapt it to any dish that you're going to use it for. So I hope you enjoyed this quick recipe today. Feel free to rate the video and leave a comment letting me know what dish you used it for. So that's quick and easy basil pesto, thumbski.